I do want to lighten it up a little bit. Not saying that I didn't love that part of I love that. <laughs> everything everything was amazing. Um you have a song called Try. I did. And I, and I absolutely love that song. Um and I I don't remember who was featuring on that, but um it, it's just me, but it was produced by Blue Lab Beats. Boom. Uh, okay, yeah. I might be thinking of a different song that had a feature, but no. Regardless though the 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 message of the song was was fire because you talk about trying at all costs right basically yeah. like it's okay to persevere and try and so yeah. i'm somebody who likes food i like trying <laughs> new food so yeah. what's what's some of the best and worst foods that you've ever tried Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, i love that um first let me say I'm Jamaican, so I could eat Jamaican food every day for the rest of my life and be content. I love it. I, um, I'm with you on that. Just amazing. Just amazing. Like the curry goat, oxtails, oh. cow foot, everything. Hey. All of it. Amazing. Um, oh. And I'm a foodie too, but so I'm trying to think of like the, the worst thing. <laughs> so, so the best so the best so the best is Jamaican food? Yeah, the best is, that- is definitely Jamaican, hands okay. down. Um, okay. you know what? I will say this. Um there's like a Swedish uh I wouldn't even say it's a dish, it's a fish thing. Uh it comes in a jar. It kind of remind reminded me of anchovies. Oh um but I I I wasn't really getting down with that. Um, but, anchovies, yo, do people yeah. still eat that? People yo, when do. I hear people when do. I hear the word anchovies, I think of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Come on, <laughs> right, right, like legit. I think of no. that. I don't know anchovies, why. Are, anchovies are in Caesar, uh, Caesar dressing. Caesar dressing, yeah, which mm-hmm. I enjoy. What? Uh, I love yeah. Caesar dressing. That's, like the, that's, that's my that's my favorite dressing. dressing. That's my that's favorite the dressing. base of it. That so it has that taste because of the anchovies. Wow. Yeah. Okay, I didn't know yeah. that actually. Yeah. So, yeah, it was. Um, try everything once. I will say, try mm. everything at least once, and um, if it sticks, it sticks. But fish in jar in a jar, that that's just not <laughs> that's not it for me. Nah. Nah, I'm with you on that. <laughs> right. <laughs> sardines. That's not in a jar, but I'm not. I, I, I'm not a fan of sardines. I used, to, I, used to, I used to eat it growing up. I used to eat it all the time growing up. And I think I, just, I think I'm just tired of it growing because eating, eating it so much. Right. Growing up. Right. It's like your system yeah. is now rejecting it because it's like mm-mm, yeah, too my much system, here. It won't even make it to my system. The smell of it. Is <laughs> I'm, I'm cool. Oh I'm, man. I'm cool. Yeah. Justin, we. I. As bad as that is. Yeah. Uh, we're we're both Nigerian. There okay. is something called cola nut. That oh, might top. Man. That might top the. Uh... Now what? What is that? Because I haven't heard of that. Cola nut. Yeah. It's like a, how would? What is it? Uch- <laughs> I mean, I, to be quite honest with you, I'm not certain if it's a fruit or a vegetable. But basically, mm-hmm. imagine a. Um, imagine something the size of like an acorn, right? It's okay. you know like a you know, nice little size nut. You crack it open, and um, it's really hard, by the way. Okay. And so it's very bitter. I think that's what Q is getting at. Like, mm-hmm. like literally, you can take like you can eat like a little piece of it. It will destroy your taste buds for probably the next three hours. Oh man! <laughs> no, no, both. Like all what? you're gonna be tasting is that. But see, but see, the important part about it is it's a, it's a very like spiritual and cultural yeah. okay. um, food, right? It's used right. at like. Special occasions, Wedding. people use okay. weddings. They come together, pray over the play, pray with the cola nut. It's one of those. Like nobody, gotcha. I don't think people just eating cola nut in their everyday <laughs> right. life. You know what I'm saying? Walking down the street, like, oh, oh, damn, I'm hungry. <laughs> I, I don't think it, I don't think it works that way. Right? Like, okay. I hope, I hope not. At least okay. I can legit see cola nut on Fear Factor. Like, <laughs> oh wow, <laughs> wow. Okay, and I'm assuming you you're not gonna get this at the supermarket. Like, you need to go to like your specialized like oh yeah, like, like African supermarket or something. Absolutely, you got there's you. no there ain't no way, man. If, if I ever see cola nut in Whole Foods, I'm I'm calling the cops. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, I'm calling right. somebody, man, because that ain't right. <laughs> that ain't right. Okay, damn. Yeah. You guys put me on because I have never heard of this, but um, it seems <laughs> it seems interesting to say the oh, least. But, 
Nigerian cuisine is amazing. I'm, I'm sure right. you about something. Oh, it's amazing. That oh, that man. that I can uh, validate, but I, I don't know about the cold nut. <laughs> yeah, see, <laughs> see, that's why. See, that's why I felt I felt you. We talked about Jamaican food because yeah. in my mind, I. I mean, the the food doesn't taste the same per se, right? Uh, right. Jamaican food versus like Nigerian food or whatever. Right. But like to me, it's, it's the same palette. concept. It's the same, it's same concept. concept. Yeah. yeah. Same yeah. concept. Like yeah. the food may have you may have different dishes, but like the comfortness, the way you feel yes. after eating it. Oh my yes. God, it's nothing yes. like it. And the seasoning, like, the seasoning, the seasoning, that that very, seasoning you know, is just mm-hmm. that's what really does it. Um, and uh, goat goat meat. Shout out to goat meat. I don't even uh, know why I'm shouting out goat meat, but goat meat is my favorite. It's my favorite. Goat, Growing it's up, it's so good. It's so mm-hmm. good. It's Amazing. like, listen. I think we were we were. I think we could say we we're all privileged to have you know that sort of diversified palate at a young age. Oh you know? yeah. Oh one hundred percent. Oh yeah. I'm super yeah. grateful for that. Yeah, me because there are people walking yeah. around here that's like, "Yo, man, I only eat pizza and right. I only eat fries." Right. <laughs> Yo, I saw. By the way, this is off topic. I saw. Uh, I watch this show called the Eighty Five South Show with my uh, fiance every now and again. She loves that okay. show. Um, DC Young Fly. She go. You know, I don't know if you you guys. Are yeah, familiar, yeah. But anyway, yeah. So uh, they had a guest on who was basically bragging about not drinking water. And I'm like, fam, you're what? you're in your twenties. You only drink water. You don't drink water. You only eat fries. You all- same thing with Lil Yachty. Like, I don't know if you guys ever heard Lil Yachty speak about what he eats in an interview. He legit says he only eats nuggets, fries, pizza, chicken tenders. That's mm-hmm. it. He yeah. doesn't <laughs> eat anything else in this planet. And now it's lemon pepper wings. Someone just put him onto lemon pepper wings. Oh, apparently. really? I, I yeah. saw that. I was- yeah. <laughs> He was like, I never had lemon pepper wings before. Where have I been all my life? Yo, oh man. man, that's crazy! It's unbelievable. I can't. Un- I don't relate, and I will never. I, yeah, but it's yeah. cool. I can't personally relate. Um, I feel like if your palate is not diversified to an extent, your mind can't possibly be. So mm, uh, I'm kind of like, <laughs> I like you that. know what you're dealing with when, when you when you have a person who only. I guess eats chicken nuggets, um, <laughs> you know. So <laughs> is that, I guess <laughs> it is helps that with your expectations. <laughs> is that enough to not take a step forward with somebody in a relationship? Like if they're mm-hmm. pally, absolutely. You think so? I would oh. say so. Yeah, I would say. Well, I say I say that because see, I feel like you could look at simple things, and those simple things can speak for a lot. Right. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. people say things without even saying things. Right. So if, mm-hmm. if someone, I guess, kind of has, um, I guess, this limited uh, palate by choice. Right. Like not Close-minded. because they have an allergy or whatever. Right. Yeah. Just because of a I literally just don't want to try anything I'm not familiar with. That tells me a lot about you as a person. Right. Mm-hmm. You you're not even trying to be risky with your food. So, mm-hmm. like, I, I'm mm-hmm. definitely expecting you to, like, not want to maybe travel, not want to, you know, mm. get to know other cultures, like talk to different mm-hmm. people. Like, mm-hmm. that's just that's a great thought. point. No, yeah. that's a great that's point. I, I never that's really up. thought about it like that, how food is your, your food diversity and your food is really connected to maybe your train of thought. I, yeah. Yeah. yeah, I never really thought about it. That yeah. that makes sense though. Makes sense. I'm agreeing with the premise. However, <laughs> right. I'm sure there's some people. I'm sure there's some people out here who would be like, "Man, what are you talking about?" Man, right, right, right. And I like is traveling. No hate. All I all I like right. eating fries. Like right. I don't know. This is so no hate you- to the chicken nugget eaters at all. You know. <laughs> oh yeah. I'm not yeah, six yeah. Piece on any given day, but yeah, for sure. There's levels to this, you know. <laughs> there definitely is. There definitely yeah. is. So, so Justy, what, where did that name come from? Is it part of your, your like real name, actual name? Well, so <clears throat> when I was younger, I was in a band, um, an awful band. Uh, with, <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> yeah, All right. It was bad. You know, um, we were a band. There was like 12 of us. We had zero songs, but we were in a band. Um, wow. <laughs> yeah. So my best friend uh, was Gabby, right? And her whole thing was, you know, we're going to be the front people, like our names should rhyme, right? So my middle name is Justina, right? Um, my first name is Chantel, but my middle name is Justina. And I was like, oh, okay. I could just like slice off the the Ina and I'll just make a Justy. So we had Gabby mm-hmm. and Justy. 
Um, so that's where that came from. And it, it, it just stuck uh, the entire time because, um, yeah, I don't know. I just like, once I had it, I was like, all right, this is kind of cool. So we'll just stick with that. And that's the story of that. And I'm like, people always ask that. They're like, you know, where's the Jesse from? Or like, like, how did that happen? And I'm like, it really happened because I was trying to rhyme with my best friend. So um, <laughs> that's the story <laughs> behind that. that. Yeah. Yeah. Not, well, well, shout out to her for rhyming. Which is, shout she out still Gabby. Doing, is, she, is she still doing music too or no? No, no. Gabby doesn't do music. That was the, that was the thing too. Like, no one wanted to be in the band but me. So I feel like, you know, they were just my friends. They were just trying to like, you know, support my vision. But mm -hmm. um, shout out to Gabby mm -hmm. either way, because she gave me my name essentially. So mm -hmm. shout out to Gabby. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know Gabby. Gabby, but shout out to you. <laughs> shout out to Gabby. You, 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 you are part of the music in one way or another. Yes. That Justy is delivering to the world. So, we, yes. you know. mm -hmm. um, so what's next for you? I mean, what what you got on the what you got on deck? Singles, music yeah. videos, performances. Yeah. What's next? So the next single is gonna drop on May twenty first. It's called One Two Three, and it's gonna feature uh, Rad City, who is a producer from Philly. Uh, she's been going crazy and doing a bunch of stuff. She just um, did uh, a Khalil record um, that he just dropped. So. Uh, Rad City is on it. She produced it. You know, we've collaborated in the past. Uh, so it was really good to get together with her and work on that. And that'll be the last single we release um, before my debut album, So, which will drop in June. So um, one, two, three on May 21st, the visual and the single are going to drop on the same day. So this mm. is the first time we've done a double double and I'm, I'm super excited for it. Um, <laughs> you know, the video has like a nice fun, comedic concept so it's gonna be good and nice. then you know after single i'll finally be able to do uh my first live performance it's gonna be here in staten island we're having like a little hip-hop festival so i'll be performing at that in july but um you know besides that i'll have a lot of cool visual assets to go with the album um leading up to drop and even after drop like we still have more music visuals coming so um it's gonna be a lot of content uh heavy things on the way and i think after the album i want to get into a space where maybe i do do like a single a month because mm -hmm. i've never done that before mm -hmm. so i want to see what it's like to kind of um have that experience where i am dropping kind of back to back to back because i've always taken so much time in between dope, okay. dope. and just yeah. to, and just to clarify i want to make sure i heard you right you said yeah. rat city not rap city no, 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 Rad City, Rad City. Yeah, yeah. All right, yeah. all right. I just want to make sure because I'm like, you said <laughs> that's City. super low key. I'm like, no, hold no. up, man. <laughs> I think I would have been a little, a little bit more braggadocious. Yeah. yeah, that's how I was like. Hold <laughs> on, let me. I'm like, let me add some more sauce on today. If I heard right, you correctly, right, right. All right, I got but you. maybe you know, let's manifest that, okay? Because I'm trying oh, to, yeah, I'm trying oh, to be yeah. out here. <laughs> shout out right. Rad City, man. Like, yeah, we shout put out Rad together. City and Rad City. So, um, yeah, yeah, <laughs> and more collabs too, more collabs, um, absolutely on the way as well. You know, I just been linking with a lot of different producers and uh, creating these tracks, so it's cool to be in a space where I'm just making a lot of songs, um, as opposed to me like piecing together the album, which I spent basically all of quarantine doing. So, mm. yeah, I'm looking forward to the album. I'm, I'm yes, yeah, absolutely, I'm gonna send y'all the. The private link, so oh yes, please yeah. do. And then we might pull up. Ooch, ooch, what you doing in July? Right. I think I I don't think I've ever been to Staten Island before. Um I haven't. You know it's random. Time. I've been to um I've been to Long Beach. I most people okay. who are not from uh New York don't even really know there's a Long Beach in New York, but yeah, yeah, there there yeah. is, and it's it's like super weird too. I don't know why. Like I just got weird, <laughs> weirdo vibes from from Long Beach. Beaches don't belong I don't in know New why. York. Like New York doesn't have like a beach vibe. So I just feel like <laughs> yeah, it was strange. It's random. Yeah. It was very I'm telling you, the vibe was very strange. But I mean it's all good. Listen, shout out to people out there. Hopefully, they're not as weird as I actually think they are, but whatever. Uh right. <laughs> but no, yeah. if y'all want to pull up, you know, July. Staten Island, you know, details will be on my website as we get closer. So no doubt. Um, yeah. Yeah, if we ain't doing that, we'll definitely pull up. 
Yeah, July, yeah, yeah. hopefully things the weather's better. Hopefully people back outside. You know. Yeah. That yeah. kind of thing. Yeah. Get the station wagon out, Ooch. We the going, <laughs> we going to New York. Get the station wagon out, bro, dude. I don't even think the people. I don't even think those are made anymore, man. Station wagons. Station wagons. Listen, I feel like if you have one. <laughs> If you have one, there's some value. Yeah, that's there's a collectible. value there. Yeah, yeah. and it's in like pretty good condition. I, yeah, I legit always used to laugh at people with with station wagons. Like that was never a cool car to me, yeah. me personally, <laughs> ever. You can't. I guess you can't add any like sauce. I mean, you could throw some rims on your station wagon. You know? No, no, no. You know the last station wagon that was cool. You know the last one that was cool. The Dodge. Uh, what was that Dodge? Damn it. This is early. This is mid two thousands. There was a Do- Magnum. The Magnum. Remember Ooh. the Dodge Magnum? No. I gotta look that up. Oh my! God. Go yeah. look up the Dodge Magnum. That was definitely a station wagon that looked cool in all the hood people and the and the gangsters was throwing rims on the on 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 on, on the on the Magnum. I'm telling you, look it up. It's <laughs> definitely a station wagon. I will oh, not see it right now. You're right. Yes, I've seen these. I have see? seen these. I got these have a little bit more drip to them. Yes. Yeah, because I could definitely see someone throwing some rims on this and, and, and making it look real different. So, wow. So that was the you, last. Oh, I'm telling yeah. you, that was the last popular one that I, yeah. legitimately, I legitimately remember people driving around. And I used to be like, I understand y'all threw rims on it, but it still doesn't look cool. I'm still laughing at y'all. Right, right. But, but the car <laughs> doesn't look that bad from the front. No, it the car doesn't like, look that bad at all. It looks like a Walmart Maybach. <laughs> yeah. Is it is it the great value Maybach? <laughs> <Is that great? laughs> the Maybach truck? Yes. <laughs> wow, you're right. But listen, somebody who's ambitious could take that. They could put the lights yeah. on the ceiling, like in the Phantom. They could really like yeah, ice, ice this bad Stop. boy out. It's yeah, still my ride still. My ride is still all right. Like, <laughs> hell nah. It's been, it's, been, it's, been, it's been discontinued for like almost twenty years now. Knock we gotta off. find exhibit. We gotta find exhibit <laughs> and bring him back. Yeah. Well, uh, <laughs> well, 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 Justy, uh, thank you for for pulling. Oh, and sorry. Before we get out of here, where yeah. can the people find you at? Like social media wise. Yeah. So on Instagram, I am at Justy J U S T Y. Uh, music on Twitter and Facebook. I'm at Justy's Music, or you can go to JustyMusic.com and just find everything. Awesome. Dope. Yeah. Dope. Dope. When dope. Uh, all we all I ask from you, Justy, is that when you become this mega superstar, which is going to happen like in a few months, probably. Don't forget <laughs> about me. Please. Oh man! I did beg, Don't forget about me. Yeah, please, please. <laughs> dollars. Listen, or I like got that. you. I, I, I got can, you. I, I will give you my. Uh, I'll give you my pay stub. Uh, I don't know why you need that, but listen, you might make it big, <laughs> and you're gonna need my bank account info. So you right, know, help, help the right number, out. all that. Give yeah, 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 exactly. I got you guys, and listen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come to DC at some point. And uh, you know, we can link or something because oh, yeah. this has definitely been a vibe and I appreciate the energy and you know, as an artist, like this is the stuff that we love to do, um, you know, besides creating. So it's platforms like this where you can tell that people really care, you know, and it's not just like, Can we have a pull quote? <laughs> you know, so uh <laughs> yeah, I appreciate you guys and what you do and I hope you you understand and see how you know, influential this is to the community and to artists. So I appreciate it. Mm. Yeah. Appreciate it. That meant yeah. Res- respect. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. All right. We'll talk soon. All right. All righty.